it was exciting. When you're a free agent, you start looking at, at teams where you're a good fit. And uh, actually, I'd run into Tino Martinez in the offseason. He was the one saying, you know, you'd be a good fit over there. And, uh, you know, I think at that point, you just start looking at the team, and the Mets just seemed to be that fit. And from day one, even going to spring training, it, it felt good. Shea was great. I, you know, there's there's something about the older stadiums that the newer ones don't quite have, and, and I think that's noise for Shea Stadium, just the noise that you can feel it in your feet, the sound that just comes out of center field that echoes through the stadium. Shea just had a really cool feeling when, when you're playing there and we were playing well. But I think uh, Matt Franco's hit, hit a game-winning hit against the Yankees at, at Shea, and it it was just a, I think at that point we were still trying to find our way, and, and it was a, a great hit. One, two to Franco, line drive, base hit in the right field, Henderson scores, here comes Alfonso, here comes O'Neal, throw to the plate, Alfonso slides, he's safe, the Mets win it, the Mets win it! Matt Franco with a line drive, single to right, and he's being mobbed by his teammates! You know, before walk-off celebrations were celebrations, it, it was a really good one. Uh, you know, Maddie doing it also made it special. It was a long rain delay, and I, I think guys were just looking for something to, to break it up and, and laugh a little bit, and I became that guy. I don't know if that was me. I think Mike was the one that actually did that. I think the thing you're talking about, John Franco talked Mike into going out there and doing that. Ventura is waiting. It's been raining the whole day, long game, 15 innings, so everybody's tired. But Lynchy staring in has his sign. Once it was tied up and you're going to the plate, I think there, it becomes a different at bat. A 2-1 pitch. The drive in the air to deep right field. Once I hit it, I, I knew we had won, but they didn't really know, you know, didn't follow it all that much. That ball is out of here! Out of here! A game-winning grand slam home run! I was going by first base, and Matt Franco was, I could see him at, in the corner of my eye, so I thought, okay, well, maybe it dropped. And then I saw it go over the fence. So I'm thinking I'm going to run around the bases. And then I see Todd Pratt, who I, it confused me because I'm thinking, how did he get out? Why is he going this way at me? And, uh, you know, I think at that point it got a little crazy. They're mobbing him before he can get to second base. The Mets have won the ball game. More people remember it just because of uh, it being a little unique and, and being different. Uh, I, it was very fun to be part of. I think even the players, it was, uh, it was crazy. Never been part of anything like that.